listen, some of y'all men are going to have to settle. Okay, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, but everybody cannot have a perfect man. There's not enough perfect women to go around. And even if there is, they don't want you. Cocaine is a hell of a drug. <laughs> and in addition to that, some of us evil, lazy women, we want love and affection too. Like, you, everybody can't get a kind, caring, loving woman. Some of y'all are just gonna have to settle for us evil, lazy women. I beg your pardon. I beg your pardon. And while we're at it, we can just go ahead and put that 50-50 conversation to rest. Some of y'all are gonna get 80, 20, um, 100, negative 10. Wait a minute now. This is satire, right? This woman cannot be serious. Women lean more on their beauty than they want you to believe. Women rely heavily on their beauty. <laughs> What's going on everybody and welcome back to another video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle on that notification bell. That will let you know every time I upload content, you know what we're gonna do. Yep. Roll that clip. Meaning some of y'all, y'all gonna have to pay the bills and cook and clean. Some of y'all are going to have to pay the bills and clean, and all she does is just cook when she feels like it. And some of y'all men, y'all just going to have to do everything. Y'all going to have to do everything. Y'all going to have to pay the bills, cook, clean, and she, her primary focus is making sure that her children are taken care of. Also, but you, you actually also going to have to help with that too. My point is, I know a lot of y'all men want kind, loving, caring wives, but they don't want y'all. And so y'all are going to have to settle for us evil, lazy women. And y'all just need to accept it. Listen, a lot of the good women that wanted to be wives and be nurturers, a lot of them are already married. What does that leave left? Some of y'all are just going to have to take us evil city girls. Okay, some of y'all are just going to have to take some of us hoes and leave us as hoes, but we just wives. You know what I'm saying? Like... Some of y'all are just going to have to settle. You can't have your cake and eat it too, is my point. See, this woman is just upset at men. Because for number one, men don't want you. No man in his right mind would wife you up, reproduce with you, or even look at you. Yep. So you get on your phone, you get on TikTok, and you complain about what you can't. Again. Yep. Now they say there is somebody for everyone, but I doubt there is anyone for this woman. This woman reminds me of that other woman that looks like a man that has a mustache who's also overweight that wants to claim she dates high value men. And complain about paying for anything, the date, parking anything like they complain how i know i'm talking to a broke man versus a man who's not not rich not even rich just has a job has a place financially stable as a grown adult should right it be the complaints like i know right away when i'm talking to a guy who i just swiped right on we matched and he's talking about oh but i you know why don't you know we we go to a park or something for the first day. Why don't we? You know, it doesn't always be about money. It could just be about us spending time. We could we could be just hanging out at the beach, and I'm fine with that. But I know you're saying it because you're broke. Don't deny it, because then the the same guy is, is gonna be the same one that says, oh, we should go fifty fifty on rent if we live together because women are empowered now. No. Also, let's look at the flip side. The only type of man that would date or reproduce with this type of woman is a broke man, a simp, 
a loser, an incel, a MGTOW, or a guy that's just down bad to the point that he'll take anything that's moving. We're living in a new age, guys, where we have the power. It's, and women don't like it. We created the movement, drizzle, drizzle. Drizzle, drizzle. Just like women created the movement, sprinkle, sprinkle. However, drizzle, drizzle is more prevalent than sprinkle, sprinkle. The difference in dating between men and women is this. A woman does have to settle. Let's keep it a bump. Men date who they want. Women date who they can. I'll explain it like this. If you take a man and a woman and you put them side by side, economically, as that man gets older, economically, physically, spiritually, and mentally, that man is going to mature. He's going to grow. He's going to become more valuable. He's going to become more financially literate. He's going to become more financially stable. And the older that man gets, the better and more valuable his value is. Now, we're going to look at a woman. A woman at 25, as she gets older, she develops baggage. She develops things that go on with her. She goes through trauma. She has more baggage. She might have daddy issues, mommy issues, family issues, friendship issues, trust issues, you name it. As that woman gets older, her value plummets. So as a man gets older, he increases in value. As a woman gets older, she decreases in value. That's the reason why we always ask women, what do you bring to the table? So if the only thing that a woman brings to the table is her looks and nothing else, which is the majority of modern women in today's dating market. Guess what, ladies? Looks fade. Your looks are a depreciating asset. A man's money is not a depreciating asset. Because if I'm trading my money for your looks, it's an uneven exchange because just like a stock, your looks are going to go down. My money, a man's money, is going to go up. That's why when we're asking women, what do you bring to the table? And they say, we are the table. We don't take those women seriously. Because your table is a depreciating asset. Men that have money, men that are financially literate, do not invest in assets that depreciate in value. What typically happens is that they will sell it or trade it as a woman gets older, if all she has going for her is her looks, when she gets older and her looks begin to fade, her value is gone. As a man, we don't just place value in our ability to provide. We place value in our economic status, our mental status, our physical status, our career status, where we are in life, but the vast majority of modern women have one thing in common. The only thing they bring to the table is looks. Yes, women go to college more than men, but they're going to college for useless degrees. Yes, more women are buying houses, but they're not able to afford houses. 
See, this is what happens, ladies, when you try to be like a man. There's men and there's women. A woman cannot be a man and a man cannot be a woman. But you don't see men competing to be women. You see women competing to be men. Yep. And when you see that, you have to understand that a lot of these women that are competing with men to be men never had fathers growing up. Talk about settling. A woman has to settle before a man has to settle because a man can always get more money. He can always get more assets, more connections, more experience. But with a woman, you're on a different playing field. Your time is limited versus a man's time. They're infinite because once those looks fade and you're depending on looks, when the world went into lockdown, men, we went out to work. Women, they got naked and took their clothes on. You can tell Jesus that the bitch is Lord, have mercy. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Women ran to the main thing that they know will generate money, which is their body. Women lean more on their beauty than they want you to believe. Women rely heavily on their beauty. So when the going gets tough, what does the woman do? Get naked and do only things. When the going gets tough for a man, what does he do? He goes out and works. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle that notification bell. That will let you know every time I upload content, you're going to see me right after this at the end of this video. Hit that link to the next video that will be on the end screen. And until the next video, peace.